Hello internet. Today, we're not gonna be working on the sub wall thingy, but jiggy in the back, no. We're gonna be flipping the rear axle because uh, currently, well, I'll show you how just, just, just how monumentally high it, it is. There's a, there's a bit of, there's a bit of arch gap. Yeah, it's about, it's a lot. Now off that one, the breaker video, I did a few videos back, uh, I managed to pick up this which is a rear axle which is already flipped and it's got um, the disc brake conversion on it and the discs are really in good condition. Obviously we've got drums on this and when we're pulling as much weight as we are, that's not really gonna do. These are in okay shape. Um, I will be replacing them at a later date, but I'm just gonna slap them on for now and that'll be hunky-dory. It's also got, what I believe, a 25 mil spacers on it, which means that the wheels that already stick out are gonna stick out really far. So, I've got these bolt on arches and it's gonna look fucking splendid. Because of the back of this van uses leaf suspension, which is all rather crusty, um, you've got these U-bolts, right? So the idea is that you flip these U-bolts, so basically these leaf springs are below instead of on top of the axle and it lowers it by about, I don't know, what's that, 12 inches? I've already taken the liberty of taking this apart because one of the slider pins in here, this one was all right, this one down here was completely C. So I knocked out the slider pin, put some CV grease in it, straightened everything up and put it back in. It is bloody lovely now, works a treat. The discs are smooth, no scoring, and the pads have got plenty of life left in them, so I'm not too worried about that. What I am worried about is how the hell I'm supposed to lift this, which probably weighs the best part of about 55 kilos, on my own. So let's run through quickly what we actually have to undo. So we've got to undo these shackles. We've got to undo where the shocks come off at the top, which is rather hidden. Um, the brake compensator spring's got to come off. All four of the... Well, to be fair, if I can drop the whole leaf, that would be a lot easier. But we'll, I don't know if that's going to work or if I'm going to be strong enough to actually lift the leaf back up into place attached to the axle. So we'll play that one by ear. Uh, so this bolt, the same on the other end. The shock bolt the brake compensator valve, and the brake lines have got to be undone. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Look. Yeah. Down low. Up top. On my way to the bag at the bus stop. Bus stop. Some blow. Some flop. I ain't get my shot yet, but I'm gon' pop. Gon' pop. Don't stop. Keep going. I got this mantra in my head and make me keep flowing. Poor shot. I think the best course of action is gonna be to leave the shocks bolted on till last because then the axle can kind of swing on them. Because if I take the shocks off, this thing weighs so much, I might die. Um, so I'm gonna undo the front and the rear of the leafs. Put the compensator valve and the brake lines off probably first. Yeah, so brake lines, compensator valve, front and back of leafs, then shocks. I think is gonna be the best way forward. Must have never heard me rap. That's a fact word. The system got me on my back. What's the answer? Down low, up top, up top. On my way to the bag at the bus stop, bus stop. Some blow, some flop. I ain't get my shot yet, but I'm gon' pop, gon' pop. Don't stop, keep going. I got this mantra in my head and make me keep flowing. Poor shots, keep pouring. It's no more vodka in my head, got no release for it. Fucked up, son. I'm passed out. I don't wanna breathe. I just wanna pass out. What I'm not gonna do is undo the leaves from the axle while it's on. Because if I try and do it while it's off, it's gonna be a real bitch of a job if you start swinging round. So for safety and lightness, I'm gonna take the axle off. I should probably take the handbrake off. But I'll get into the drum for that. That's annoying. I just saw that shit to God, yeah. Down low, up top, up top. On my way to the bag at the bus stop, bus stop. Some blow, some flop. I ain't get my shot yet, but I'm gon' pop, gon' pop. Don't stop, keep going. I got this mantra in my head, it make me keep flowing. Poor shots, keep pouring. It's no more vodka in my head, got no release for it. Now I'm in the game, I was 
on the bench. On the bench. First I was renting, now I'm collecting rent. Run it up. First it with the beamer, now I want the bench. Spending all the back, like here I go again. Outside says the chirp, now the camera's on. Told you I'ma make, keep the channels on. Why you acting different when the camera's on? Why you acting different like your paper long? Eight day wake up and I thank God. Bad decision got you wishing you could say nah. My city gritty, you could get hit any day now. Nah. On my mama, I'ma move, I'm finally way out. With some twenties, fifties, hundreds, thousands, millions, billions, trillions, zillions. I'm talking Amazon money, talking so much money I could mess around and buy Amazon. I been winning, I'm like why me? I heard these labels wanna buy me. I don't need you boo, I style me. I roll G's and they grind me Now I'm on my game, nothing is the same Who am I to blame, money made me change Cardi in my ring when I'm switching lanes Money in the carry on them boring planes Money in the carry on them boring planes Now I got a buck for all those rainy days Ain't have a day off in like 80 days I got hustles in like 80 waves Kids if he won't take a lazy day Wife eat with me, told me take a break I keep going to the paper street then it's trips up to Montego Bay If I take the job, bet I get it done I said it before, I'm a one on one I just caught some ones, only wearing ones Fornicate the funds, money made me come Diamonds on your neck, bet they on your neck You want that watch, you better rock it back Looks as though under here We're actually in pretty good shape Unbelievably Sure there's bits of rust here and there, but Overall, it's 25 years old. Can't really complain too much. So the plan now is to take the leaves off of that and bolt them to the underside of this one. Off that and underside of this one. I've not done this bit before, so not sure how, um, yeah. then good for you thank you very much very kind of you however because you made it this far here's some spicy little bonus content that most other people won't see as you will tell I am covered in full of dust my hair's gone grey what's left of it anyway because you know I look like the McDonald's logo at the minute but it's getting there thank you very much for watching I know the uh, videos are few and far between at the moment but this is really boring to watch and it takes forever. So, I promise, things will kick back off again. You can hear, can't you? Actually, I'm gonna put the back wall on. And now, hopefully you'll have an idea of the scale of this thing. It's fucking enormous. Anyway, I've been Adam. Thank you for watching this far through the video. It really is appreciated. It's quite echoey in here. I'll catch you next time. I don't know what the fuck this is, but I'm doing it. <laughs>